Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to remove the recommended section in the start menu on Windows 11, which you can see right here. So you probably know you could go into the settings and disable this so it doesn't show anything in the recommended section, but it still leaves the word recommended here, which may be fine for some people, but it's kind of annoying if you don't even want this here. So here's where you go into personalization and start, and then you can turn off any settings you want from here for recommendations. All right, so this process here will work for Windows 11 Pro and I think education version, but for some reason it does not work with Windows 11 Home. You could try it, but I don't think it's going to work for you. So what we're going to do is a simple registry edit to make this change. So I have two files here, one to hide it and then one to bring it back if you change your mind. So here's what the hide recommended registry file will do. And then if you want to bring it back, here's what the show will do. All right, so to hide the recommended section, we're just going to double click on the hide recommended registry file. Say yes to the UAC prompt, so you'll need to be an administrator to do this. So this is just telling us that it's going to add the information from this file into the registry. So we'll click on yes, and then OK. And now we need to reboot for the changes to take effect. So we'll do that real quick. All right, logging back in. All right, so let's click on Start. Now you can see the recommended section is gone, and it looks like we have some extra room for our icons. All right, so now let's say you change your mind and you want it back. Just do the same thing with the Show Recommended Registry file. Okay, we'll reboot again. All right, so now we click on Start, and now we have Recommended back again. All right, so like I said, I'm not sure why it doesn't work with Windows 11 Home. I actually got this from somebody on Reddit, so I did not uh, come up with this. So you may be able to figure out what needs to be done to make it work with Windows 11 Home. But for now, I'll put a link to these registry files in the description in case you want to try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. Mm -hmm.